Caustics are bright patterns that appear when light is focused on surfaces after reflection and refraction. In our scene, we see caustics as bright light patterns next to glasses. Caustics play an important artistic role in both photography and visualization. In this tutorial, we'll show you how to set up caustics and get a perfect shot. First, import the glass model into Light Tracer Render. We found a nice CAD model on GrabCAD that you can simply drag into the Light Tracer window. Since it is a CAD model, it is important to pay attention to the tessellation settings to get high-quality renders. Next, activate the special caustics mode and choose the quality rendering preset. These settings should be used for most jewelry renders, as well as other scenes with complex lighting. In general, to get caustics, we need to ensure three things. First, we need an object in our scene that can focus the light. It can be reflective or refractive, and, in our case, it's the glass. To refract the light it needs the glass material applied. We will use bump map for some surface imperfections. Second, we need a receiving surface where we can see the focused light. Typically, it's a rough diffuse surface with high albedo. Finally, we need a small bright light source such as the sun or a bright spotlight. Note that Light Tracer has a built-in sun and sky environment model. Alternatively, you can use one of the HDRI maps from the library or import your own. Make sure to set enough samples per pixel to get a noise-free render. For complex scenes you may want to set up to 8000 SPPs. Also, note that you can use one of the AI denoisers to remove any remaining noise. Thanks for watching this video. Let us know what you think about the new caustics mode in the comments below. See you next time.